created by uh, NAC as well. So before going to the courses and the placement part, I will also give you a short, you know, campus tour, which is a quite beautiful. So please uh, check out this campus. So they offer automobile engineering, uh, artificial intelligence and machine learning (AML). They offer mechanical engineering. They do have uh, you know biotechnology engineering part of the course, and computer science engineering (CSC). And they have a civil engineering also, and triple E, which is electrical and electronics engineering. Then comes the aeronautical engineering, and electronics and communication engineering, which is your ECE, and information science and engineering and CSC with data science and finally mechatronics engineering also they do have MBA courses now coming to the seat matrix so as I showed 11 courses and computer science engineering CSC is the highest number of seats 180 seats electronics engineering 120 seats and information science 120 seats so if you put together this itself is the 420 seats between computer science electronics and information science and then there is a new branch called EIML which is 60 seats so if you put together computer and ECE put together is a 480 seats so too many seats are there in this college and apart from that thousand around total thousand now, the uh, fees part of it is, you know, right, KCET, it is uh, around 90K per year, 90,000 rupees per year. And for Comed K, it is around 2.21 lakhs per year. But also, I'm giving you the uh, cost of boarding and lodging facilities with the hostels. So, it's basically 1,15,000 for three sharing and 1,52,000 for two sharing. So, this is includes your you know, hostels and the mess facilities both. But it's for, so it will come around 1.5 lakhs if you want to go for two sharing. Now talking about the placements part of it. So they, they have not given much information on the placement part. But this is a snapshot from their website which says that you know, uh, you know they have a good placement with respect to that that they have 200 plus corporates visit them every year. But this is overall Acharya level and not applicable only to engineering part. Also if you see they have mentioned that uh, uh, the highest salary was 65 lakhs per annum. Not sure with which company this offer is, right? right? But if we go with the NRF data, right? What data they have provided to, you know, uh, NBA, which is for, uh, you know, NAC as well as the NRF ranking. So if you see the last three years placement as per the NRF data, 
the the last year 951 students were eligible to we were graduating but out of 951 students only 316 students got placed so which is very low placement and the mid median salary is 4 lakhs previous to previous year it was 954 students who were graduating and only 407 got placed and the median was 3.6 lakhs and to previous year also only 215 students got placed Uh, and the median salary was three point six lakhs. So if you see last three years placement median, neither the median median salary is very high, nor the number of students placed are high, and the number of seats are very very high. So that 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 is a point. You know, you cannot go beyond anything like computer science or information science or ECE in this college, right? And that also you should be selecting. very cautiously so you see in lot of good colleges in bangalore or outside bangalore in mangalore 